Hello my friends and welcome back to the channel. Today I want to very quickly talk about the difference between motivation and discipline and how I think understanding that is absolutely essential to you staying sober, getting sober and indeed making any great change in your life, moving forward in any way. I touched on it in the last video and I'll link that to this one. Just before I do that, the channel really needs some help and support. If you feel like helping out in any way, please click on the Ko-fi link in the description and have a quick read. I'd be really grateful for your help. Thanks so much. So yeah, in the last video, I, one or two people asked a question because I, I, I said fairly bluntly, I suppose, that motivation um, is bullshit and discipline is what's important. Of course, motivation is a great thing. I'm, I'm not knocking motivation in any way. The point I'm trying to make in this video that I hope you'll pick up on, there's something that I've learned the hard way, is that motivation will ebb and flow. It will come and go. Some days you'll get up in the morning for no reason and feel motivated. You'll think, oh God, I feel great. Maybe you've had a good night's sleep or your life's going well, things are running smoothly. And you'll think, um, I'm ready to face the day now. And you'll accomplish many, many things with that motivation. And that's a great thing. But a couple of days later, you may have had all sorts of crap happening to you in your life. You may have had rubbishy night's sleep. All sorts of things may have happened. And you wake up without that motivation, feeling low and lacking energy and feeling like you don't want to do anything. That's when it's important discipline. That's when it's the, the difference between staying sober and relapsing. You know, for me, it's very fresh because if you've been following the videos over the last couple of weeks, you'll know that I had a slip when I was back in England. You know, and I look back on that now and, I, and I've thought long and hard about it. And I'm very big on discipline. But while I was there in England, you know, I was letting that discipline go. I was becoming complacent and, um, and just sort of flowing through the day without working on my sobriety in any way at all. You know, if I was motivated to do it one day, as I've just described, then I would do it. Um, but the discipline had disappeared and the consistency had disappeared because discipline's best friend is consistency. You know, discipline, I remember Mike Tyson describing it, the boxer Mike Tyson describing it as doing something that you hate doing that's uncomfortable as though you love doing it. And I think the important thing is to be doing it consistently, day in, day out, whether you feel like it or not. And that's the difference between making any great change in your life, indeed staying sober, indeed accomplishing anything you know, and when the motivation comes, that's brilliant, you know, and you can use that motivation to, to, to accomplish even more in that day. And that's a fantastic thing. But the most important thing you have to rely on with any change, because change is painful. Staying sober is painful. It's no walk in the park. You know, people turn around and say, you know, so being sober is great. Well, it is. It's amazing to be sober. It's amazing to make change in your life. It's amazing to move forward. But sometimes it bloody hurts. You know, it, 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 it's, it's uncomfortable because for you to move forward in any way normally and make any change in your life, you have to step out of your comfort zone. You have to face fear. You have to face physical discomfort, mental discomfort. I've just drunk the worst green smoothie with um, a probiotic kefir in it. The worst tasting thing ever, but I know... <laughs> I know that it'll set me up for the day and I know it's good for my gut, it's good for me mentally, it's good for me physically, it'll give me energy, you know, and that's discipline because it would have been really easy for me to have a bacon sandwich this morning, simple. You know, if, uh, if I was relying on motivation because I, I didn't feel that motivated to drink that green smoothie this morning, but my discipline made me drink it and that's what's really important. So you need to use that in your sobriety and, and indeed in making any massive changes in your life. Discipline and consistency. Consistency is key because if you don't repeat day in, day out, all those little things, all your daily routines, the, the things that you can let go and become complacent about, if they're not repeated 
day in, day out, day in, day out, you will slip backwards. You will become complacent. You will start to rely on when you feel like doing it or when you don't feel like doing it. And then you will relapse and you won't make any great changes in your life. So I hope that's been helpful for you. Please, please click on the Kofi link and give the channel a bit of support if you can. Please subscribe. Carpe diem, my friends. Keep moving forward. Discipline and consistency. Much love to you all. Bye-bye.